Welcome to Nightmare 365. We're at the Dempsey House in Middletown, New Jersey, one of the most haunted houses. On Halloween night, local legend has it, Mr. Dempsey came home, killed his whole family in the basement. After realizing what he did, hung himself in the tree out front. Many kids trick-or-treating that night thought it was just Halloween decorations. Come to find out the next day, it was Mr. Dempsey's body himself. This is an old pump house, spring house. A lot of people claim that it was the site of a couple murders. But really, there's nothing more than a pump house for the property. Another local legend has it that Mr. Dempsey was bedridden. He had a caretaker that would bring up water, food, bathe him. Then one night, the caretaker never came back. The police got a mysterious phone call to say, check out the Dempsey property. And when they got here, the police officer went inside when he saw the gruesome scene that was inside, no one knows the full story, but then the officer came out front and hung himself in the front of the property. So there's a lot of hangings here on the property. I don't know if they're really true or not, but just from the look of this house, if it was on the second floor, the second floor is pretty small. Yeah, let's see what's in that pump thing. Or no. Yeah, we're, we're walking. Walk down since this was a pump house. And this whole property, it's about like two, two and a half acres from what I've read. It's pretty big, yeah. G's a little cold and nervous. I'm not nervous. It's just like 30 degrees out here. You kids get out of there. Ah oh, shit, it's filled up with water. It's kind of interesting to see this property right here, still untouched. And from what I remember, even in high school when we used to come here, there wasn't these big houses around here now, but you could see all the houses that are around here. In high school, these weren't here, they were just still woods themselves. And across the street, we'll get a better look at it. You can still see that fence, like the P-stone fence. But this is unchanged for at least 20 something years since we were coming here in high school talking about the same local legends. Dio, do you feel this place is haunted? It's definitely creepy. I would definitely love to go inside though and see what it's like. I mean, it's standard for how many years? Vacant, abandoned, haunted. Who knows what you might find inside? It's pretty nuts. Yeah, if you can go in here, would you? I mean, yeah. Yo, right here, back in high school, we came here 20 years ago. This was actually open, and we were here late at night with like eight friends. One of our friends had a flashlight, and when we were peering inside, he looked in and said he saw something, dropped the flashlight right here and ran. I'm sitting here trying to find the flashlight and then we all booked it down the street. Yeah, supposedly like the that. still hangs today. Shit, it's the cops. <laughs> 